In this video, we will help you understand how your emails are sorted and grouped within your mailbox and how you can change that to meet your particular needs. There are three factors that determine how your mailbox is displayed. These are sort order, grouping, and if you have a column grouped, whether or not the group is collapsed or expanded. When you set grouping on a column, it means that all items of a similar type are grouped and displayed together. Let's look at sort order first. The default sort order is to sort the last modified column with the most recent item shown first. We can see the down arrow on the right of the column indicating that column is sorted in reverse order. Clicking on the column will reverse the order and you can see that arrow now points up. On a Macintosh, the column that is sorted is even more obvious as the column header is a different color. You can sort on any column by clicking on the column header. Clicking again reverses the sort order. Any column can be sorted. The way you leave it is the way it will stay until you change it again. The default grouping is on subject. This means that all replies to a particular topic are kept grouped together. Notice on Windows there is a little minus sign to the left of the column. On a Macintosh, this is an arrow pointing down. If we click on the symbol in the column header, the group collapses and all you see is the first message in the threaded group. The minus sign turns to a plus on Windows and to an arrow pointing to the right on Macintosh. Clicking again will display the entire group. With grouping on, each item within the group is sorted based on your sort order. You can also do the same to collapse or reveal a single topic thread. If you wish to remove grouping altogether, hold the control key down on Windows or the Option key on a Macintosh, and click on the little plus or arrow if on a Mac. To set grouping again, just hold the same key down and click on the column you wish to group. There may be times that you wish to group on name or date to make it easier to find what you are looking for. If you ever get totally confused and need to get back to the default view, then it's easy. Click in the mailbox list and choose View Change View Properties. Click on the Default button, do not click on Apply, and click on OK. Voila! Your mailbox is back to the default order.